Yeah. Let's add the rest of the water. Yes, yeah. citric acid and the baking soda. <laughs> They combine to release carbon dioxide that blow, that is flowing as the lava. We have received another package from Little Passports, Krishna. Do we want to see what's inside? Yes. The kit had two experiments, Krishna. These are to simulate a earthquake and this one is to build a volcano. What all do you have to build a volcano? I have got some baking soda, citric acid, a measuring spoon, glue, beaker and a island, some paper and clay and plastic glass and plastic tree. Oh, nice. So let us begin. First to place the cup in the middle of the island cutout. So let's take our island cutout and then put the beaker on top of it. Okay. I put it on. All right, now we have to open the clay and stretch it out. Ooh, look at how gooey that clay is. Let's pull it, pull it, pull it like that. Okay. There we go. Alright. Now let's put it all around the beaker. That's good. Yes. You have shaped the clay all around the beaker to form a volcano. We need to add some grass. So we will spread some glue at the base of the volcano and spread the grass on it. Are you ready? Yes. Alright, let's open the glue. There. There you go. Now the glue is spread all over the place. Let's add the grass powder. Okay. Some more here. A little bit on this side of the island. Mm. Now let's plant our tree. Yeah. There is good. Look here. There you go. Okay. Good. So now you yeah. have an island with a tree. Yeah. We're gonna wait for our clay to set. Then we'll perform our experiment. Okay that the clay has dried. Let's continue our experiment. What do you want to add? Baking soda and citric acid. One spoon and another two spoon then three. Okay. One more. There you go. Good job. Okay. Use your scoop to mix them together. I'm going to mix them. Can okay. I stop? Yeah. Good job. Now, let's add some water. Okay. Let's do it. Wow. What happened? It's erupting. Yeah. Let's add the rest of the water. Yes, yeah, citric acid and the baking soda. They combine to release carbon dioxide that blow, that is flowing as the lava. <laughs> yeah. That was fun, wasn't it? Yes, it was fun. It was. It's turning the grass yellow. Yeah. So, lava is molten rock. It comes from the crater of the earth when there is seismic activity. Now, let's learn about seismic activity. Yes. The earth is made up of tectonic plates. When they move against each other, they form tremors and this gives rise to volcanoes and earthquakes. Let's do this experiment simulating an earthquake. Let's open it. We have these two cardboard pieces which are tectonic plates of the earth 
we have some plastic balls we have some wooden blocks and rubber bands first we attach the two cardboard pieces together with the rubber bands now add the rubber balls in between the two layers of the cardboard okay so, let's add two of them in each side yeah let's add two of them in each side now that we have the balls between the two plates we are going to build the blocks on top to form buildings you want to go ahead and build them so this is a tall structure let's see what happens when the two tectonic plates move they fall they fall okay let's make another structure and see what happens they fall down they fall down yes so now let's move the two tectonic plates to see what happens to this structure hey what's happening it does not fall it does not fall it's very stable so engineers use this knowledge of seismology to build structures that can withstand small earthquakes this was a good learning experiment Yes it was. Yes, let's give a thumbs up to this little passport seismology and volcanology series. I loved it. And I loved it also.